Hello everybody. I wanted to share my last project uh, in the altered spoon or and fork uh, challenge from JB Ladies Scrapper 48. Uh, thank you very much Karen for this wonderful challenge and I wish everybody good luck. Again I used a wooden spoon because I had uh, several laying around uh, unused and I, this was the original idea that I had in my head and um, it took me a while to uh, to get it done. Uh, first of all I um, started out with uh, the wooden spoon and in this case I uh, I painted it with um, acrylic paint then I put over that some uh, a coat of gesso to make it a, a little uh, tex textured then I um, used the script stamp and uh, my brown stays on timber brown stays on ink to uh, put some uh, script over it and after that I lightly distressed it with vintage photo and for the banners I uh, I used uh, a pen from my husband it was uh, ripped so uh, I cut uh, banners out of it and frayed the edges, you can see that here just with my nail I frayed it and then I uh, I decided I wanted to, the word live on there on the first banner the, word, the letter L and on all the letters I put uh, some flatbed pearls in champagne color um, all around the banner I glued some ribbon and here I made a bow from sheer ribbon it's a golden uh, color on top of there there's a, a clay heart uh, that I bought a few years back then in between the banners I um, made a bow out of jute rope this is a, a, do, a, a flower that I crocheted myself and I put a flatback pearl in the center the banner for the V uh, I um, glued on a piece of spray and I have the spray and I um, cut off branches so I glued on one branch, uh, put on a wooden bird uh, that I painted because it was more uh, of a dark brown and I painted it with acrylic paint. And then on the last one I cut out a heart out of a cardboard box just like I did letters and uh, glued on two buttons and a piece of rick rack ribbon and uh, that's it and I actually like it so much I'm gonna hang it in my living room so uh, that's my project uh, thank you all for watching bye bye